Why do you really, really, really want to lose weight? You got to be clear on that. Clarity is key. It's Kathy here with Weight Loss God's Way. And at the time of this recording, it is the new year. Although it doesn't look like it by this background here in the forest, all the snow's melted. But anyways, today I want to talk to you about clarity. As I said, clarity is key. And unless you're clear about why you want to lose weight, you're going to continue to try this and try that and jump here and jump there because you don't know what you're really going after. So clarity around losing weight involves more than saying, I want to lose 20, 20 pounds, 50 pounds, 100 pounds. Yes, that is your goal, but why? Your why could be something like, because I need more energy. Because I want to be able to walk without being in pain. Because I want to glorify God in my body. Because I want to end the cycle of diabetes that's in my family. Because I know I have a purpose or a mission deep down inside me that God's place and I can't do it. Because I can't move around, I don't have the energy to move around like I want. It could be to get off my blood pressure medication. I want you to take some time and write out all of those reasons. Because here's the thing, when we just say, I want to lose 20 pounds, but we haven't thought about why is this so important, why is this so compelling, then when the, great, the smallest temptation comes by, we cave in. Because we forget, we forget about the bigger goal. We forget about how important your goal is. And you forget about who is relying on you to achieve your goal. And the impact that it's going to have not only on you, but on generations to come. And we've got to get that deep about it because we need the motivation. We need the encouragement. We need the encouragement that goes deeper than because I need to lose weight or because I want to feel better. Yes, all those things are good but it's not gonna be compelling enough to get you off the couch. It's not gonna be compelling enough to get you moving when you don't feel like moving. It's not gonna be compelling enough to say, throw away that chocolate bar or those french fries or whatever it is you're about to binge on, right? So think about your why. Think about what's deeper and the impact that losing weight is going to have on your family, on others in your sphere of influence. All right. Go ahead and hit subscribe if you're new. I was trying to think of whether I should share more, but once I start, I won't be able to stop. So I'm gonna end it there. And if you want more on this topic, you can go to weightlossgodsway.com and watch my masterclass. Sign up for a masterclass. It's going to give you all of these nuggets that you need to help you break free from what's been keeping you stuck. Choose a time that works for you to watch it. And I know that you're going to be blessed. I pray God's best for you in your health and in all areas of your life. Bye-bye.